I miss you when I can't sleep Or right after coffee Or right when I can't eat I miss you in my front seat Still got sand in my sweaters From nights we don't remember Do you miss me like I miss you? Fucked around and got attached to you Hey guys, so today I'm going to record a video on how I do my makeup every day and this is it. It's very basic, but it is all full coverage because if you continue watching, you'll see I have a lot of spots on my face and um, I just, I gotta cover them up. If you're interested on how I do my makeup every day, keep watching. Up with it girl, rock with it girl, show them it girl, with a bang bang, bang with it girl. Normally the everyday makeup is very simple. But because I have so many spots on my face and manchas and just blemishes, I prefer just something a little more full coverage. I already moisturized my lips off camera before I started recording with these. Every winter, I used to get a third lip, I'm not even joking, it was like a huge burn mark underneath my lip. And it was from, I guess, licking my lips and then the cold air hitting it. So I literally tried everything, nothing worked until I found this one and I never got that third lip again in my life. For moisturizer on my face, I normally use St. Ives. I recently went to a dermatologist because I was breaking out a lot and she suggested another moisturizer. I tried to ask for samples first so I can see how my face reacts to it and this is it. I really like this one because it's oil control and it has sunscreen. I get oily everywhere on my eyelids, just all around. We're just gonna put that all over the face. Pockets overweight, getting heftier. Come and put a king, that's a fuck cryer. Whenever you're putting something on your face, you're gonna wanna dab it in. You don't wanna smudge because you don't wanna create uh, wrinkles later on. Next, we are going to prime the face. I have been using this Too Faced Primed and Poreless primer and I'm not sure if that's one of the causes to my breakouts. I don't think that this was made for oily skin. I'm gonna get like a pea-sized amount. I'm gonna put it all over my face. moisturize and my primer sit for a couple minutes before I continue. Because I have so many spots on my face, I normally color correct. This is the NYX color correcting concealer palette that I use. Real quick on how the color correcting concealers work. Green basically cancels out like the pinkish and reddish on your face. So like for example, I'm going to put that here. Maybe a little bit on my neck because I have a spot on my neck. Purple brightens up the face so I normally put that where I highlight and like around my eyes. Peachish, orangish colors kind of cancel out like darker blemishes on your face. So I'm going to put that like here where I have this and then under my eyes. <laughs> Honestly, sometimes I feel like I put this all over my face. I'm just gonna blend it out a little bit so that it's not so harsh. That looks a little crazy. Next, I apply my foundation, and I have been using the Urban Decay All Nighter Waterproof Longwear Liquid Foundation. That name's a little crazy. I'm just gonna put a pump on my hand, and I'm gonna blend it out with my brush. And the brush that I'm using is the Spectrum A02. And this is just a flat top buffing brush. I did use this yesterday because I tried to record this video yesterday and my battery died. She cut the aubrey into skinny pieces. She bear with her face, man. I love it, baby. It's okay, money need a hearing. It's okay, buy me out of seen a shade. Switch up my style to give me lay. I switch up my car by cooling me pain. The shade that I'm using is the shade 6.0 and the way that the shades work, the .0 shades have a more yellow undertone 
and the 0.5 shade have a more pinkish undertone. I'm a monster boy. Every day people try to dress me up. Uh. Every day people try to end me up. Uh. Pull off in our own store, SV up. Uh. Pockets overweight, getting hefty up. Uh. Coming for the king, that's a far cry up. Uh. Can't come alive in the full time up. Uh. No competition, I don't really listen. I'm in the blue, more sand, but the new edition. How soon do you need a centerpiece? So already my face looks so different. I really like this. I put only one pump on my hand and I was able to do my entire face because not so much product sticks to the brush. I normally use this NARS concealer and I can't remember the name. I finished and I found this CoverGirl one in my drawer. So we're going to be using So we're going to be using it. The name is a little faded away. I think it's called Ready Set Gorgeous. <laughs> Recently, this is what I've been using to set my foundation, to set my conceal. Tarte Amazonian Clay Bronzer. But it's such a light color that it matches my skin. The brush that I'm going to be using is my Spectrum C07. This is really um, a sculpting brush because it has that point so you would use this to like you know but I'm just gonna use this all over my face I'm not a big fan of the Makeup Forever HD powder if I happen to take a picture after putting it under my eyes, you can see it. There's like a flashback. What I do use it for is for my nose. I use glasses and at the end of the day, the makeup sticks to where my nose goes. And then I end up having no makeup on my nose area where the glasses would sit. So if you use translucent powder around your nose, it'll set that in. <laughs> I'm just gonna let that sit there. The blush that I have is my matte. And the color is Dolly Mix. It's a sheer tone shimmer blush. A lot faded. The blush that I'm gonna be using, or the brush, blush, or oh, blush. The, bl the brush that I'm gonna be using is the Spectrum A05. And it's a fluffy brush, but it's like angled. I don't think it really matters. I don't know what this actual brush is for, but this is what I'm going to use it for. I'm just going to grab a little on my brush. It's talking about me on a scene of shades, which I'm not starting to get The highlighter that I'm going to be using is also from MAC. The color is Soft and Gentle Mineralizing Skin Finish. The brush I'm going to be using for this is the Spectrum B05. It just looks like this. This set did not come with a fan brush, which I hate. Until I find a fan brush that I like. The primer that I'm going to be using is the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion. This one is an original. I also use a paint pot on top of the primer. Because I'm so oily, I kind of need like double the priming strength. And the paint pot that I'm going to be using is Painterly Pro Longwear Paint Pot from MAC. I'm just going to grab some on my finger and spread it. The color that I use for over is from my Anastasia Beverly Hills palette. I put it together with my own colors and the color that I'm going to be using is called Soft Peach. It's a matte peachy pinkish tone. This one. I'm just going to apply it with my Spectrum A07. I'm just going to put this all over my face. <laughs> Not all over my face. <laughs> all over my lid. But just like you would set under your eyes or set your foundation and your concealer and all that. That's basically what I'm doing. I would do my eyebrows with Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow Pomade. I really, really love it. 
restaurants, you need a centerpiece to want a table. So I just moved to Maryland and it's been very hard for me to find someone who I'm happy with when they do my eyebrows. So I learned how to do them myself. So my all-time favorite, my ride or die mascara is the it's called Plush by MAC and they discontinued it. I don't know why. I have this Makeup Forever Smoky Extravagant Mascara. It has a big fluffy like spoolie and I'm definitely loving it. The way that I apply my mascara, I brush my eyelashes up and twist at the same time. I'm going to sweep away the translucent powder with my Spectrum A00. It's just a big fluffy brush. For lips, I don't have a big collection. The lipstick that I would wear every day is my MAC Angel. It's from the Frost line. It's a little jacked up. I don't even know how that happened. <laughs> Looks like my dog chewed it. I don't even have a dog. Okay. Oh my god. With a face, man, I love it, baby. It's okay, money, need a hearing. I do set my foundation with my Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. You don't have to do this. I'm just being extra because I have oily skin and I want it to stay all day. And then I'm done. Thanks for watching. This is how I do my makeup every day. It's a little full coverage only because you saw I have a lot of spots on my face. You don't have to take all the steps that I took um, if you don't have any spots on your face. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Thank you so much for watching my video. I appreciate it. Wait again, hefty, uh, come in, put a king, that's a fuck cry, uh, car come along. If you're interested on how to make it, uh, focus. I just do it because that's what the YouTubers say to do. And when I tried it, it worked. Don't kick it! <laughs> you're so rude! <laughs>